This is a project that I used at Maker Faire and I call it Tapetricity because you're doing electricity with tape and in particular this tape here. This is comes in a roll and it's aluminum tape. Originally the roll looked like that and after a couple hundred projects it ends up looking like this. This cost me about seven dollars at the hardware store. It should be in the plumbing aisle. Aluminum tape is a good way to um, ask for it. And uh, basically what you do is you build an electric circuit kind of like this one and there's the LEDs, there's the battery, a little bridge that goes over to the back side of the battery and then there's there's that. I found it was also useful to have some example circuits like this one here. It had a little switch on it that would cause it to blink and uh, you can draw the schematic symbols and stuff. I also found having a sheet that had just the basic circuit concept. This is the uh, information for the series circuit. Um, I didn't add a third LED to this because even just two LEDs barely, barely even lit it up. And the um, basic simple circuit uh, worked out just fine. Uh, this is what a lot of people made was basically this circuit. One LED that lights up um, or a parallel circuit like this one. Two LEDs that light, that light up. I thought this one was kind of fun. And basically the inside of the circuit looks about like that. And so you got a strip here, a strip there. The battery is taped over um, from the back side of it to um, the other edge there. And then the LEDs are taped down. I found it's helpful to um, do the drawing first, figure out where you want the LEDs, spear a couple holes in it with um, a sharp thing like a push pin or this is um, a pin like a button and uh, so spear those holes, put the LEDs through, put them uh, on here. You, you might have to go into telling the difference between um, uh, LED, uh, the legs, uh, the short one is the negative, the long one's the positive. And um, well, basically they'll only work if you wire them up in the correct orientation. And uh, so basically what happens is you cut a lot of this stuff up. You can cut it up beforehand or you can just cut it up as you go. And I found that a one inch strip like this, it's a two inch roll and just cutting it in half, this uh, worked out pretty good. Uh, as far as price goes, it's I think amazingly inexpensive. You probably already have scissors. You probably already have tape. You probably already have paper. LEDs are inexpensive and you can find them um, in, in a number of different places. Pens you probably have access to. I got these in the dollar store for a dollar for a pack and I don't know, there's maybe three dollars worth of pens there. And the LEDs, those are inexpensive. These ones here I also got in the dollar store. This is a three volt coin cell battery and this strip of batteries right here was three dollars. Uh, I'm sorry, it was not three dollars, was uh, one dollar for this. So um, five batteries, 20 cents, pretty affordable. Um, after I cut a lot of the tape, um, I used some citrus cleaner to clean off the scissors because they got pretty gunked up. And, um, and the roll of tape, $7 for a roll of tape. And you can get hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of projects out of one roll of tape. So there's that Tapetricity. Definitely give it a try. It's a lot of fun. Kids had a great time doing their drawings and then making them so that they light up. It was uh, definitely a good time and they, everybody gets to take it home because it's so amazingly inexpensive. So give it a shot. Try it out. Build some neat circuits and um, build some more neat circuits. <laughs>